Mr. Quick Spot. Oh, yeah. All right. I tell you what, the er a person who believes that this wasn't set up by our own government is an idiot. Okay. Uh, good morning, uh, grade 11. Uh, I'm the presenter for the Purple Group. Uh, I will discuss uh, a lot of issues now, right now. Uh, we're going to start by what is a sentence. A sentence is the two parts. First part is the subject. Second part is the predicate. And the two main phrases is the phrase and the clause. The two parts of the sentence. The simple sentence a sentence con uh, co consisting of only one clause with a single subject and predicate. Example, the dog, the dog barked. The dog barked at the cat last night. This question is odd. Here is odd. The complex sentence. A sentence containing a subordinate clause or clauses. Example, because my coffee was too cold, I heated in the microwave. So, he was very rich, he was still very unhappy. What are the four types of a sentence? The compound sentence. A sentence with more than one subject or predicate. Example, she did not cheat on the test for it was not the right thing to do. So, uh, I think I will buy the red car or I, uh, I will leave the blue one. The complex and the compound sentences. A compound sentence consist, consists of two or more independent clauses. A complex sentences or, or sentence has at least one independent clause plus at least one dependent clause. Example, although I like to go camping, I haven't had the time to go lately and I haven't found anyone to go with. Clear? Is it clear? Green group, orange group, red group. Clear? Yes, Sahabi. What is a clause? A clause is a group of organized word contain a subject and a verb. There are two types of clause: independent clause. Uh, a group of organized words that contain a subject and a relationship but cannot express a complete thought. Dependent clause. A group of organized words that contain a subject and a verb relationship but can express a complete thought. Examples. Glassers often leave behind holes in the ground. Is that an uh, independent clause or dependent clause? Orange group. Come on, easy stuff, huh? Easy stuff. Come on, it's clear. Independent uh, clause or dependent clause? Okay. I enjoy sitting by the, fir uh, the the fireplace and reading. Blue group. Come on, blue group. Dependent or independent? Independent. Independent. Okay. Uh, she wants to travel the world <coughs> and see wonderful sights. So come on, yellow group. Mr. Liban, <laughs> independent. <laughs> so, uh, our plans revolve around the sun. Uh, Miss B. San, what do you think? Oh, come on, Miss Farah, you return back to the school. Independent. Okay. Are you sure of that? Are you sure of that? Is it dependent? Yes. Yes? Yes or no? Yes? <laughs> when the president uh, arrives, 
Is it dependent or independent green group? Mr. Omar. Okay. Is it dependent or independent? Are you sure of that? Okay. Let's skip this issue right now because we don't have enough time. We are going to move to the conjunctions. <clears throat> there is a... Okay, conjunction contains of uh, words and, but, or, nor, for, yet, and so. By a semicolon accompanied by a conjunction adverb such as however, <coughs> moreover, nevertheless, as a result, uh, consequently. So, uh, there's a comma as plus. Conjunction is a word that lays, uh, lays between two complete sentences with a comma before, before it, so the sentence does not make a commas plus. Uh, uh, there's examples about uh, the no comma, although, though, even though, despite, in spite of, when, while, after, before. Uh, examples for conjunctions uh, You can eat your cake with a spoon or fork My dog enjoys being be bathed or beaten But hates getting his nails trimmed Bill refuses to eat uh, peas nor will he touch carrots. I hate to waste a drop of gas, for it is very expensive these days, or those days. It's a grammar mistake, huh? Okay, I'm going to talk about the errors. Uh, the result for... Errors the result from. That result from. Run-on sentences. A run-on is a sentences in which two or more independent clause, i.e., i.e. is the short form for the independent clause. Uh, complete sentences are joined without an appreciate function or conjunction. Fragment. Fragment or incomplete sentences. Usually, fragments are pieces of sentences that have become disconnected from the main clause. Okay, we we'll have enough time. Uh, and there's uh, something called a comma plus, but it's not here in the PowerPoint. So uh, it's an error occurs when there are two complete sentences in a big sentence without putting a conjunction, a conjunction, or a transition word. Example: Ahmed is a football, a footballer, comma. He is playing in a club, or maybe my team. So uh, <clears throat> I forgot to talk about uh, something uh, called the fanboys. Uh, the fanboys is for and more, but or yet. So uh, that um, related by the conjunctions. Yeah, maybe conjunctions. I'll get back from the conjunctions. Yeah, it's related by the conjunctions. So, uh, it's very important in the SAT, the fanboys. It will really help you. Example, although Yusuf studied hard for the SAT, but he didn't make it in October's trial. So, it's about the conjunction too. Okay, uh, we have not, we haven't enough um, time yet, yet, so I'm going to say uh, thanks for watching us and listening to Perfect Group. Uh, and if there's any problem, if anyone want to discuss something with me, I'm here. There's 18 seconds, 17, 16, 15. So I think no. Thanks for listening to us.
Okay, we have finished our time, but uh, there's a quiz. So I want to ask you so quick what we will do about that quiz. Shall I answer that? Okay. You got your time? Okay. Now, there's the quiz. <clears throat> what is the type of the error? Ahmed giving Hussam a call. What is the type of the ear here? Ahmed giving Hussam a call. What is the type of the ear? Is it comma spells? Is it fragment? Is it. Uh, huh? uh, there's no PowerPoint for the quiz. Okay, Ms. Salma. Fragment. Fragment, yeah. It's fragment. Okay. Muhammad always, Muhammad always plays play basketball. Come, he is professional. So where's the yeah Miss Pora? Come aside. Yeah. Put a suitable condition. Muhammad is condition. Muhammad is a footballer. Come, he sometimes play volleyball. He also play sometimes volleyball. There's a space before Muhammad, okay? Put a suitable condition. Conjunction. Again, okay. Miss Nuran? And. And. No? No, it's not. Me. Again? Okay. Space. Put a suitable, a suitable conjunction. Okay? I'll start the sentence. Space. Okay, Muhammad is a footballer. Come, he sometimes play volleyball. Okay, Miss Farah. No, Miss Sarah. Yeah. Okay, Ahmad got a good score in the SAT test. Comma and an empty space. His family give him a reward. Is in gave him. Gave him. Okay, Mr. Rissi. So. Okay, so. yeah. Uh, an empty space. Okay. Thanks for listening to us. Okay. This is an Islamic school. I'm talking about tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's rolling the hard way. We don't want to roll quite that hard. We want to get one of them little minibuses. who believes that this wasn't set up by our own government is an idiot. Everybody's gone out of their mind. Welcome to Mr. Quickstar. Welcome to Mr. Quickstar. Welcome to Mr. Quickstar. Oh yeah. All right. All right.